Right, good morning, everybody. Thank you, everybody, for all your messages about Rosie. She's okay at the moment, folks. We had a, a fairly um, uh, sleep, a sleepful night last night. It was amazing, actually. We were both up at half past six this morning, but then uh, we fell asleep again at half past seven, all the way through to about quarter past nine. So, yeah, we've, we've rested. We're fine, folks. But Rosie, in particular, is good. Don't worry about me. Yeah, I'm okay. So I've done all the housework, taken all the bins out, got to do the hoovering, going to the shops now to get Rosie some magazines. Uh, all the family's coming over today to see how Rosie is, of course. And Chelsea Lee's coming to stay early and look after Rosie all day while I'm at work. So, uh, yeah, everything's, everything's okay. She's been up on her leg today as well. Well, it's really swollen, man. You should see it. It's awful. But you've got to keep moving and get these things sorted quickly. So, uh, a rainy day. And off we go. Right, folks, not much happening in the world of Jag today, I'm afraid. Just uh, had to work, come back. Now it's quarter past four, and I found a rare 50 pence piece. It's Peter Rabbit. Now I looked on the internet, internet for this, and it's worth about 35 pounds. But, however, there is an old man who lives over the road for me. He collects them, Fred, his name is, and he comes to the bingo and he's always asking if we've got any of these uh, Beatrix Potter ones to complete his collection. So, I found it, but I'm going to give it to him because he's uh, he's an avid collector of the coins. He might already have this one. I don't know. I'm sure he's gone on about squirrel nutkins and something else. So we'll see if he needs this one to uh, add to his collection, shall we? Yes, let's do right. this. Fred lives just behind this big hedge. So we're going in. Now, it's a bit of a sad story here because Fred uh, is a lollipop man and his lollipop lady wife, Helen, died uh, just last year. She was one that, whose grave I went to visit up at Pitcairo. And she saw our family across the road, uh, myself, my brother, and uh, my sister as well. So, you know, and they live just over the road, so we've known them for years and years. So this is where Fred lives. Got a lovely garden. Well, we his nose is in much the same place as that nose. Let's have a look. All right, okay, yeah. Right? right yeah. But he's, it's pointed. Ah, man, unfortunately, Fred had that one already. It's Squirrel Nutkins and... Mr. Prickly Hedgehog is after. So, oh well, never mind. He was he was awfully happy though. Uh, just to, that we're looking out for him. So there we go. So that'll add to my collection. I've got a, a Beatrix Potter one, I've got Jemima Puddle Duck, I think, and also this one now as well. So there we go. Right, let's go in and see how Rosie's getting on, shall we?